So I'm going to show you how to start an online business that brings in at least $1,000 per day in profit. Okay. Now let's get straight to the point. Who is this video for? Now this video is for you specifically if you're searching for ways to start an online business from the comfort of your home. You don't need any experience and you don't need any tech skills. Okay. So if you are a complete beginner, you're trying to start an online business, you're going out there on YouTube, you're typing how to start an online business or on Google, this video is for you, specifically for you. This is beginners friendly. Anybody can do this. Okay. Complete beginners. Now, this video is also for you if you're looking for ways to have financial freedom, time freedom, and location freedom. Okay. This video is also for you if you're looking for a way to build a passive income business from home. Okay. This video is also for you if you're just trying to earn an extra income online or maybe you're trying to start a side hustle from home. And this video is also for you if you're looking for a way to quit your nine to five job so you can live life on your own turn. Okay. So if you work a nine to five job right now that you don't like and you're looking for a way to transition to somebody to something completely different because you're tired, you're exhausted. This video is also for you. Okay. Now, if this does you, then you come to the right place because this is exactly what this channel is for. Okay. So welcome. Okay. Now, who is this video not for? This video is not for anyone who's trying to get rich quick. All right. I want to make sure I make that clear. This is going to take a lot of work. Okay. It's going to take a lot of time and effort. So if you're not willing to do that, if you're lazy and you're not willing to put in the work that is necessary, that is required, then this is not for you. Do yourself a favor, pause this video and go find somebody else because I'm not a guy for you. Okay. I do not teach people how to get rich quick. Okay. Because on this channel, we teach you how to build a real long-term and sustainable passive income business online. Okay. So guys, for a lot of you guys who don't know who I am, my name is Jostel Breslau Guarmabiala. I'm an affiliate marketer and I'm also a Christian entrepreneur, meaning that I'm a follower of Jesus. Okay. I teach ordinary people how to make money online and build a passive income business from home, specifically with affiliate marketing. Now, if you don't know what affiliate marketing is, don't worry about it right now. I will cover that later on on this video as we get on this video. Okay. Now, if you would like to check out my number one recommended method for generating a full time income from home and get instant access on more opportunities on how to earn multiple six figures from home. Just go ahead and click on the first link you see down below to get instant access to my all in one digital business program. This is a method that's going to that's going to teach you how to make a full time income online. OK. Enjoy the video. OK, part number one, we're going to have an introduction to online business. Let me first introduce what an online business is. Now, what is an online business? An online business is any kind of business activity that happens over the internet, specifically the internet. Okay, guys. For example, when you sell stuff online, when you offer services to uh, online, or when you share information specifically online on the internet, specifically, these are example of online businesses, or you can also call it online side hustle. It's up to you, whatever you want to call it doesn't really matter. Okay, guys. Basically, it's any business that operates mainly through website and digital platforms instead of physical stores or offices. Okay, guys. So everything is happening on your laptop, on your computer. Okay. These are example of online businesses. When you sell stuff on website, these are online businesses. Okay. Now, let me give you guys a, a difference between an online business and an offline business. Now, an online business, like I mentioned earlier, everything is on the internet. Okay. Everything is on the internet. All right. Everything is operated specifically just on the internet online and offline businesses operates mainly on physical locations. These are like brick and mortar businesses that people have to go to physically in person. People have to be there. So these are like, you know, when you go to a restaurant to go buy something, you have to be there in person, the restaurant, Burger King, McDonald's, or, you know, any restaurant out there. These are example of all offline businesses. Okay. These are brick and mortar businesses. Okay. Here are some examples. So you get an idea of online businesses and offline businesses. 
Example of online businesses include e-commerce stores like Amazon, eBay, or Etsy. Why? Because you can sell stuff on Amazon. Does that make sense, guys? For example, you can buy and sell products on Amazon, Etsy, and eBay because, for example, Amazon, they have a bunch of different products that you can sell, a lot of them, hundreds of thousands of products that you can sell from Amazon, Etsy, or eBay. They have so many products that you can sell on the, on, 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 on the platform, on these websites, Etsy and eBay and Amazon, right? Now, how about offline businesses? Now, for offline businesses, this includes retail stores, stores such as like clothing boutique, grocery store or hardware stores that operates in physical location because you have to go to these places physically and be there in person this makes them offline businesses okay brick and mortar businesses these are other example you can see over here of of offline businesses okay restaurants cafes and food trucks where customer dining on a daily basis to take food to go these are also example of offline businesses okay or air salons barber shops or spas that provide personal grooming services when you go get your hair cut to an air salon or when you go to a barber shop to go to go cut your hair these are all example of offline businesses okay local services like plumbers electricians landscaper when the plumber comes to your house to fix stuff in your house or when an electrician comes to fix electricity in your house or landscaper these are also example of offline businesses because these people have to come in person to, to, to get the job done on site. Does it make sense? Because the job is done in your house, in person. That makes it an offline business. Does that make sense? Now, part number two, introduction to affiliate marketing. We're gonna talk about affiliate marketing, okay? Step number one, you first need to choose what kind of online business you want to start. That's the first step, okay? Why? Because there are thousands of online businesses out there that you can start from home. You can start Airbnb. You can start an affiliate marketing business. You can start an Amazon FBA business. You can start a Shopify business. You can start a trading business. You can start a real estate business. You can build a YouTube channel. Does it make sense? There's so many of them. There's over hundreds of thousands. Does it make sense, guys? So here are example of about even six online business ideas you can start from home. Okay? E-commerce store. You can build an e-commerce store online. You can start a drop shipping business online. You can start a print on demand business. You can start a con the content creation. You can become a content creator. Does it make sense? You can start an online tutoring or online education business. You can also start an online fitness coaching business. Does it make sense? So there are, these are just a few examples and ideas for you to think about, but there are over hundreds of thousands of online businesses out there you can start from home. You just have to choose what works better for you also, keep in mind that every business that you choose is different. Okay, guys? Okay. Now, the online business that you and I are going to choose is called affiliate marketing. That's specifically what we're going to, we're going to focus on. Affiliate marketing. Okay? Now, just what the heck is affiliate marketing? Affiliate marketing is a process of earning commission, meaning money by promoting other people people's companies products or services okay when someone buys through your unique affiliate link you earn a commission meaning money it's like getting a reward for helping sell someone else's stuff so basically you're earning commission and money for selling other people's stuff okay you basically partner with all the companies out there you just refer someone to these companies and then they, they pay your commission I'll give you guys an example. This is exactly how affiliate marketing works. Example, let's say if you were an Amazon affiliate, right? This is you, the affiliate marketer, right? That's you. Now over here, there's a bunch of, pro of products that Amazon has over here. And over here, we have a bunch of uh, customers who are interested in buying Amazon's product, right? Now you, the affiliate over here, you're going to sell these products to who? To customer. And these products are from Amazon. Does it make sense? You're going to sell this product from Amazon to this customer. Once any of this customer buys any, any of Amazon's product, Amazon is going to pay you commission out in your pocket. You're going to earn commission, meaning money to you as your affiliate. That's basically what affiliate marketing is. You're basically just selling other people's stuff. Okay. You're basically earning commission money for selling other people products and services. Okay. That's all it is. It's that easy. Okay. 
you don't need to worry about customer service that's none of your business you don't need to worry about shipping the product that's none of your business either you don't need to worry about the inventory of the product amazon worry about all that that's none of your business okay you can collect anywhere from five percent to over 75 percent in affiliate commission for sim by simply driving customer to any of these products all you do is that you drive customer meaning people to amazon's product and then you're gonna earn commission money it's that simple okay and you can collect between five percent to over 75 percent like i said over here five percent to eighty percent in affiliate commission okay now let me show you step by step live how to actually start promoting any of amazon's products okay now step number one you need to go on your computer type www.google.com now once you get to google that's the google platform over here okay you're gonna type you're going on the google platform step number two you're going to uh, on the google search bar you're going to type amazon.com okay now you're going to type amazon.com once you get to the next page you're going to get to a, uh, to a page that that looks like this okay now on the first uh, and then and then you need to click on the first link that says amazon.com that's spendless you need to click on this first link over here once you click on this you're going to get to the amazon website okay this means you can promote or sell any products on this website as an affiliate any product that you show over here that amazon has you can promote it okay you can you can promote the clothing shoes and jewelry these guys you can promote any of these guys you can also promote any of these gro groceries and gourmet you can promote any of these guys okay you can also promote this 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 home and kitchen you can also promote this sports outdoors all of this so any of these products you can sell and promote them as an affiliate okay guys now how do you actually start promoting any of these products though now the way you start doing this is that you need to first create an amazon account okay now once you now how do you now this is how you do it okay you basically scroll all the way at the bottom of the amazon website okay and once you scroll all the way at the bottom okay of the amazon website you're gonna come to a place that looks like this okay now once you get to a place that looks like this you go on the on on the make money with us category okay the place that says make money with us and there's going to be a place that says sell on amazon sell apps on amazon supply to amazon protect and build your brand all of this become an affiliate become a delivery driver start a package delivery business advertise your products every single one of this now once you get to this place you need to the next you need to click on the become an affiliate okay that's what you need you need to click on become an affiliate once you do that you're going to get to a page that looks like this okay this is the amazon associate website okay you see what the amazon associate website says right there you recommend products and you earn commission okay you're going to sign up all right guys so amazon associate this is also the amazon affiliate program see what it tells you right there you sign up you recommend and you earn commission see what it says right there you earn up to 10 percent in affiliate commission meaning associate commission meaning that amazon pays affiliate about 10 percent in commission 10 percent that's how, how much commission you're going to earn as an affiliate on amazon okay now once you click on on the sign up button you will get to a page that will allow you to create your amazon account right you're going to create your amazon account okay now you will log in to your account now once you log into your account once you log into your account your new account you will see your payment dashboard where amazon will show you how how much commission how much money you made as an affiliate okay this is how much it's going to show you how many clicks how many people click on your product you know the you know how many com total commission you made how many total commission you earn so you see what the total earnings how much you made total order order items how many clicks this is this is your payment dashboard that amazon will show you okay you're gonna see this page that looks like this now let me show you how to pick products to promote inside your amazon account okay now let's say you want to promote these home cinema cables for example these are the home cinema cables that you're trying to promote from amazon right what's going to happen is that let's say you choose to promote this gopro hero 12 hero 12 black this one you choose to promote this exact product over here right once you, let's say you choose to promote that now the first thing that you need to do is that you first need to click on the product okay you're going to click on the product you're going to get to a page that looks like this okay that looks exactly like this then go on the left at the top where you see the get link text okay over here see this this is the get link text water click on that okay you're going to click on that 
and you're gonna get you're gonna get you're gonna get to a place that looks like this so say it's gonna uh, there's gonna be a pop-up okay on the get link text you you will see a short link show up okay a short link that's gonna show up this is that short link what the okay that short link is your affiliate link okay coded specifically to you all right that coded that's specific specifically coded to you this means whenever you drive customer meaning people to this specific affiliate link this one right over here this short link over here amazon is going to pay you 10 percent from the for, from the gopro this exact product of this gopro hero waterproof this this gopro hero product over here you're gonna earn 10 percent off of this four four hundred and thirteen dollar over here from this product okay picture like something like this customers these are people that you're going to drive to this affiliate link over here so your affiliate link for the gopro hero so those your link water you're going to drive them to this link and then amazon is going to pay you commission as the affiliate does that make sense now remember you need the aff this affiliate link to be able to promote the gopro hero or any of or any of amazon's product okay because this is your affiliate link this is this is going to be the link that's going to be specifically coded to you okay without this affiliate link you cannot promote the gopro okay you need this link all right guys without this link you cannot promote this amazon's product this gopro you cannot promote it okay now this affiliate link is coded to you just you only so amazon know who exactly refer the customer to this product okay does that make sense now i want to make sure i make this clear that amazon is not the only place you can find affiliate products to promote okay guys there are over hundreds of thousands of affiliate programs out there you can do that like clickbank digistore 24 jv zoo warrior plus share resell bye bye baby okay guys ebay uh, uh, you know uh sephora cj affiliate walmart best buy adidas okay h m akia coca-cola costco target okay remember your only job as the affiliate marketer is to is to promote the product okay guys and collect your commission meaning your money that's it nothing more nothing less that's you the affiliate and this products over here and then you earn money okay to you the affiliate that's it that's your only job you, you the affiliate you promote the product you earn money as the affiliate to you that's it that's your only job okay now three reasons why affiliate marketing is the best online business in my own opinion i'm going to tell you guys number one it's a 12 billion dollar industry okay and and it's projected to continue to grow every single year so the income potential is limitless number two it's it's a it's complete beginners friendly okay anybody can do this guys look you are literally building a passive income business around selling other people's stuff so you don't own this product so it's it's beginners friendly so anybody can do this because you don't own any of this product the product is already there all you have to do is just go grab your affiliate link and start promoting the link it's that simple that's why anybody can do this okay because as long as you have that link you can start promoting the product as fast as possible immediately does that make sense that's why it's complete beginners friendly okay number three all business out there need customer so companies like amazon best buy jc penny staple coca-cola adidas sephora they're willing to compensate anyone that brings them what customer because think about this the more customer a business have the more revenue meaning money they make which in turn grow their business even more does that make sense because think about this if you bring a company more customer why shouldn't they compensate you because customers make more revenue and more money when they have uh, i mean uh, businesses make more money and more revenue when they when they have more customers so the more customer you bring to them they make more money does that make sense more revenue it's that simple so businesses are willing to compensate anybody that brings them more customer it's that simple it's common sense now affiliate marketing is not only limited okay to selling physical products from amazon okay you can also sell digital products okay what is a digital product an example of a digital product is something you can use or buy online that you can't physically touch for example you on amazon you can buy a phone or you can buy a camera these are physical products something like this like a phone like i'm touching that's a physical product but a digital product you it's it's it doesn't have a physical form okay so basically it's a type of products you can access immediately and electronically 
on the internet specifically i'll give you guys an example example of digital products are like ebooks or online courses or online education program for example an ebook is a downloadable book that you can download specifically straight from your laptop or straight from your enter from the internet because it's a ebook it's a it's a it's a digital book that you read online okay a physical book is a book that you read physically a digital book is a book that you read straight from your computer do you see the difference physical it's more physical you're reading a physical book that's a book that might get shipped to your house that's physical downloadable is the is from the internet straight from the laptop that you can access electronically that's more downloadable or online education online educations are also example of digital products because this is media okay you see this through your eye you cannot touch an online education you can access an online education electronically and access it immediately that's what makes it more of a digital products does that make sense another example of digital product to sell online can be a podcast okay because this is media like i said it's media other example of digital products are software so apps okay other example of digital products you can sell or promote are video games two ways a video game can be sold it can be sold physically or digitally for example me and my cousin we used to play video games back then in playstation right some you know we used to sometimes order it to get shipped to our house okay that's you know like a like a cd or we used to go to a store to buy it like a cd that's more of a physical products but and then there was a moment we stopped ordering it to get shipped to our house and we also stopped buying it in the store and we just started buying this stuff more electronically straight from the playstation so sometimes we used to more access the the video game straight from the the the, the playstation so we used to buy it just straight from the the playstation that makes it more digital does that make sense now the four best places to find digital products to, to promote as an affiliate are clickbank digistore 24 jvzoo warrior plus okay you can also sell or promote subscription services as an affiliate all right example of su subscription services are streaming services like netflix spotify disney does that make sense online services provided like netflix for streaming movies and tv shows or spotify for streaming music for example netflix okay we use netflix in our house because we have to watch movies on a daily basis and we pay for netflix every single month to watch movies if you live in the us because i live in the united states we use netflix to watch a bunch of movies on tv and stuff like that so for example a stuff for like two buddy two buddies like a subscription tool that helps content creators grow their youtube channel right so this software pays affiliate commission not just on the first sale but every single month meaning that you earn 30 percent in recurring commission meaning that you don't just earn a one-time sale but you earn on a monthly basis i'll give you guys an example let's go back to netflix for example you see in net uh, netflix is a stream a streaming movies on demand right we pay we customer we pay for netflix to use it every single month so if an affiliate signs someone like me to a software like netflix as long as i'm still using netflix every single month that affiliate is going to keep earning commission every single month so it's going to be more recurring and passive income from the for the affiliate who signed me up to netflix and we need netflix because it's movies we need to watch movies so you can become an affiliate of companies like this and you can sign up people to companies like this and you can still earn monthly recurring commission as long as these customers are still using the software does that make sense this is another program for example uh, for example called get response this is a, a program that i use in my own business to to communicate with my customers okay so if i sign up let's say business owners to a software like this okay that it might that i might end up earning 100 dollars up front or i might also earn earn monthly commission of 32 percent on a monthly basis why because businesses need a software like this to co to 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 talk to the customer to communicate with the customer so me signing up business owners to use a software like this that's going to pay them on a monthly basis that's going to pay me on a monthly basis realize that these business owners need a software like this because they need to grow their business they need to communicate with their customers so they're going to need us to use a software like this to talk to the customer so the lifetime value of these business owners of this customer that i signed up to this software like get response is 
huge because they need to use a software like this to be able to you know communicate with their customers so they need a software like this does that make sense so this is like an example i just gave you guys you can also sell travel services okay example of travel services are like booking.com airbnb expedia they all have an affiliate programs okay now step number two now we already choose the type of online business we want to start and we choose affiliate marketing specifically the next thing that you need to do is that you need to pick a niche okay now what is a niche a niche is like choosing your favorite topic or hobby to to talk about and recommend products related to that specific topic specifically so it's like an audience you choose a type of audience you want to serve specifically in your business i'll give you guys an example for example if you love fitness your niche could be promoting fitness gear and supplement products does that make sense so having a niche helps you focus on what you enjoy and connects you only with people who share the exact same interest okay let me give you even more of an example let's say you're promoting or selling clickbank products for example okay if you go on a category you can choose different industries from business and investing computer internet cooking food and wine and e-business and e-marketing those are your niches does it make sense so if you let's say if you choose to serve customers or people specifically in the business and investing that's your niche if you choose to uh, to serve people specifically in a computer and internet that's your niche if you choose to serve people let's say in cooking food and wine that's your niche so these are example of different niches so a niche is a basically a specific type of audience that you're going to serve in a specific area of interest okay now let me just make sure i make this clear very clear so you guys understand what business really is now business is about solving specific problems of people in the marketplace okay for example if you if someone is struggling to lose weight help them go from being overweight to losing weight and being fit does that make sense so problem is overweight obese solution fit right another example of the uh, of a problem in a marketplace could be the food service industry let's say if, the, if someone is is struggling with hunger right that's the problem right solution restaurant provides what food service okay guys that's what we call business okay you number one you identify a specific problem in the marketplace number two you solve that specific problem okay now step number three you need to choose a product to sell okay guys now that you chose your niche now you need to put you need a product to sell to people so you can start making money in your business now understand that your product let me make sure i make this clear has to be in a in a specific niche so if you choose to sell let's say a product in the dating niche that means your affiliate marketing product that you're going to sell as an affiliate has to be specifically in serving people in a dating niche if you're going to choose a product that's going to be let's say in a business and investing that means your affiliate marketing product that you're going to choose is specifically going to be only focused in a business and investing does that make sense guys all businesses out there sell products i want to make sure i make that clear this is how all businesses make their revenue meaning money period okay this applies to both offline businesses and online businesses all right guys for example mcdonald's is an offline business right what do they sell this is a brand that's mcdonald they sell what burgers coke and fries to who customers all right these are the products another example could be jc penny this is also an offline business it's a retail clothing store what do they sell jc penny sell what clothes to who customers these are the products right the clothing these are the products okay another example or uh, for example best buy is also an offline business it's a retail electronics store what do they sell the brand is best buy they sell what electronics to who customer these are the products does that make sense so the same concept applies to online businesses okay guys that's you the seller you sell products online or on the internet to customers okay on the, from your laptop okay that's why you're selling the products all right rem rem remember what i said we chose affiliate marketing so this means that any products you are going to sell online as an affiliate will be someone else's products not yours okay now i want you guys to, rem uh, to, to 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 remember this that your income will only grow 
based on the amount of value you provide to people in a marketplace. Okay, guys. Now, step number step number four. Now you need to go find the exact product you want to promote or sell as an affiliate. Start promoting or recommending that exact product. That's that's step number four. Okay. Disclaimer: As an affiliate marketer, I want to make sure I make this clear. Personally, I only promote or sell digital products and subscriptions products. Personally, I do not promote physical products. Why you ask? I'm going to tell you why. It's simple. It's because no shipping asshole. Digital products and subscriptions are delivered instantly online. So you don't have to worry about shipping costs or delays. This is why the commission rate paid out to you as an affiliate is lower when someone when, when you promote physical product because of shipping cost. Companies pay for shipping cost. What do I mean by that? Now, remember what I said. As an affiliate, you don't have to worry about shipping. The product, you don't have to worry about customer service, all that, right? But your commission rate is still affected as an affiliate. Remember when I showed you guys earlier that Amazon pays you about 10% in affiliate commission? That's too low, okay? 10%, 5%, it's a really low commission. The reason why you get paid so much lower commission is because of the shipping cost. This company has to pay product to get shipped to the person's house because it's physical products. Does it make sense? Because a product has to get shipped to people's house. So you as the affiliate, you get paid lower commission. Does that make sense? That's why the, your commission is affected as an affiliate marketer when you're selling physical products. That's why I don't personally promote physical product. Does that make sense? Now, for, uh, for you know higher commission, this is why I chose to promote digital and subscriptions product because companies usually pay you higher commission. Okay, compared to physical goods, physical products, because with a you know with a digital or subscription product, you can earn between seventy-five to eighty percent commission. With subscriptions product, you can earn between thirty-three to forty percent commission. Do you see how high that is compared to physical product where you only only earn like five to ten percent? Does that make sense? Like I showed you guys earlier on Amazon. You can only get paid about 10% in associate commission with Amazon. But if you choose to go with like digital, you can get paid like 75, 80% or with subscriptions like 33% to 40%. That's way better than 5 to 10%. Do you guys hear what I'm saying so far? Another, another example of why I love to promote, you know, you know, uh, you know, digital and subscriptions product is because customers get immediate access to what they buy which makes them more likely to purchase. Why? Because when you sell digital products, let's say if you're selling like an online education program, someone can get access to it immediately because they get a, they get access to it electronically because digital products are more accessed electronically. Okay, guys? Now, another example is recurring income. Subscriptions can give you regular ongoing commission every month as long as a customer stays, stays subscribed. Remember what I talked about uh, ne uh, Netflix? earlier that we need netflix as as customer if you sign people to a net to netflix you're going to keep earning commission every single month as an affiliate that's like a steady paycheck you're earning monthly recurring commission meaning that you don't have to go get brand new customer to earn that commission meaning the money becomes more passive as long as the customer is still using this product okay and they need it you're going to keep earning commission every single month as an affiliate does that make sense part number three now let's talk about building your entire affiliate marketing business okay guys now this is a this is a 50 to 100k a month affiliate affiliate marketing business promoting multiple products now the first step that you're going to need to see over here is that you're going to need traffic meaning people now these people are going to come from platform like youtube facebook instagram uh, twitter twitter tiktok or you know linkedin or whatsapp or Telegram, and you're gonna build a one-page website. Okay, this one-page website is gonna ask a visitor, let's say, for the email address. Now, once people put the email address or the information over here, they're gonna get to a page that's called the thank you page. Now, this thank you page is gonna thank them for putting the email address here. Okay, and then once they once you thank them on the thank you page, the next page they're gonna get is your affiliate products. Now, once they buy your affiliate products, you're gonna earn money, meaning commission as an affiliate paid out to you as the affiliate does that make sense this is the way you're going to set up your entire business now let's say these people 
they came uh, that, that came in that put in the email address don't buy your your, your product and you, you don't buy uh, your affiliate products right that's no problem this is why you uh, you build this opt-in page over here so if they don't buy this product over here you're gonna follow up with them to via an email list they're gonna go through an email database once these people opt in over here they're gonna go to an email follow-up system email database that's gonna continue to follow up with them on a daily basis email number one email number two email number three email number four email number five and these emails are going to promote your affiliate products from you they're gonna promote multiple products could be affiliate products number one affiliate products number two affiliate products number three or uh, another email could be like value email where you're just sending a value email you're building trust with this customer another email could be a youtube video of yourself another email could be a instagram video of yourself because remember that these emails okay are going on a daily basis they're pre-written by you specifically you it's going to be selling your product for you so if the people don't buy at first over here there's no problem you can continue to follow up with them to continue to build relationship and trust with them does that make sense and by the way, your opt-in page over here has to match your product because it's a pre-sell page. Okay, if you if this product is about, let's say, weight loss, that means this opt-in page has to be specifically pre-selling them about weight loss. Okay, that means the people that are going to be coming in from your from your from your social media account or from your channels are going to be specifically interested in weight loss. So that means let's say your customers, your traffic, your people are coming, let's say, from YouTube. That means if your if if your product your affiliate product is about weight loss specifically, that means this opt-in page is going to be about weight loss, right? But the people that is going to be coming in from YouTube, that means they're going to be interested in specifically learning how to lose weight. They're going to be specifically interested in weight loss specifically, okay? Meaning that you're going to create content only around weight loss. So if it's health and fitness, it's health and fitness. If it's business and investing, that means your content on YouTube has to be specifically focused to people interested in business and investing. Does that make sense? And that's the setup of how you're going to set up your entire affiliate marketing business. Okay. Let's take an example of Burger King, for example. This is an hamburger fast food restaurant, right? This is, this is an offline business. The people who come in Burger King is called food traffic. Does that make sense? People, this is the traffic. They walk in burger. The same idea applies to an online business. Traffic, meaning people, is sent to your opt-in page, the door to your business. Does that make sense? Okay. People visit your opt-in page. Okay. Now, your main goal as an affiliate marketer and the secret to making a ton of money on the internet is by focusing on building your email list. Okay. The money is in the email list. Why? Because people have money in their pocket. Does it make sense? Because people on your email list, the money comes from them. Does that make sense? The people on your email list. So the power of having an email list. On average, every subscriber on your email list is worth between $50 to $1 per month. Okay? So you should be making $5,000 to $10,000 per month on average with 10,000 people on your email list. Okay? Okay, guys? Why is an email list so powerful? When you're building an email list, you're building the most valuable asset, okay? It gives you leverage, okay, guys? Meaning that you can you can email an entire email list of, let's say, 100,000 email subscribers and print money. It's like sitting in a stadium of 100,000 people. So you send one email, you print money, okay, guys? So picture more like something like this. 100,000 email subscriber is it close to 50,000 to 100,000 dollars per month in affiliate commission okay so how about you my friend how many emails do you need to achieve financial time and location freedom comment down below is it 1,000 email is it 3,000 email is it 10,000 email subscriber is it 40,000 email contacts how many do you need okay now keep in mind guys that every email subscriber will uh, every that not every email subscriber on your email list will be interested in buying your affiliate products immediately now what do i mean by immediately it takes on average seven to 20 times for someone to see your affiliate products before they make a buying decision okay guys do you see why why i said focus on building your email list 
Okay, guys. So some people are going to buy on day number one. Some people are going to buy on day number two. Some on day number 15. Some one month down the road. Some six months after or even a year down the road. Does that make sense? That's why you have an automated pre-written email follow-up system that promotes multiple affiliate products all on autopilot automatically. Okay, guys. These these pre-written email follow-up is sent daily on your behalf without you being on your on your business day number one day number two and so on okay guys this is what we call true passive income okay your email follow-ups are doing the selling for you so the email follow-up is selling the affiliate products for you for you while you out there doing all the things okay so picture the picture more like something like this email number one day number one is promoting your affiliate products on autopilot Email two, day number two, is promoting your affiliate products on autopilot. Email three, day number three, is promoting your affiliate products on autopilot. And then you earn commission to you, the affiliate. Does that make sense? You could be out there spending time with your family. These emails are doing the sales for you and earn you affiliate commission. Okay, guys? And that's passive income. Okay? The, these automated email follow-ups are meant to build relationship and trust. Why, guys? Because people buy from people they trust. I want you guys to understand that. Because people are not just going to buy from you right away. This is why you have this automation email follow-up. So you can build more relationship and trust with your potential subscribers and customer. Does that make sense? Keep in mind that the way you're going to market your business online will determine your success in any business. doesn't matter what type of business. Okay, guys? Remember what I said. Focus on building your email list. Build that email list as massive as you can. Okay? The bigger your list, the more income you generate online. It's that simple. Congratulations. You're all done. Okay? Now, how would you how would you guys would like to set this entire business life in the next 24 hours using my all-in-one digital business program? Okay? If that's you, then go ahead and click the link down below to get instant access to my all-in-one digital business program i love you guys so much i love you guys so much i'll see you guys later peace love you